Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII! Let's give Renoa a tour of the garden. We got the cafeteria here. You could have a salad if you like. Somehow Renoa strikes me as a vegetarian. I don't know why. I'm just curious. Oh, well, thanks for the compliment, Renoa. What do you mean? We've only been doing this for 30 seconds. I tried sh showing you my bedroom for fun, but no! Yeah, what do you want? Wow, you're impatient. Well, let's head on over to the cafeteria. If you take Renault to each of these places, you get sometimes some little amusing scenes or something. Ah, I guess Zell's finally going to get his hot dog. All right. Competition. Shouldn't they just, like, order more hot dogs? Whoa! Really? Huh? I guess so. What happens? Ha <laughs> ha Zell still doesn't get his hot dog. Ha <laughs> ha! Whoa! What's wrong with you, Zell? It's freaking out there, man! <laughs> well, maybe he's just a serious guy about his hot dogs. Yeah, you asked. I'm not mad. Squall doesn't get mad. Whatever. <laughs> Zell's still freaking out about the hot dogs. <laughs> By the way, if you talk to the treps over there, or the treppies, whatever, they don't say anything about uh, what, where's Keistus or anything like that. Kind of weird. <laughs> but I suppose we wouldn't know what happened to her. Yeah, we saw you freaking out here, but... You are always like that, Zell. You always like to go hyperactive. How could you be gaining some weight? I would think you'd be the most buff one of us all. Huh. Well, anyway, that's everything we can do here, so... Let's head on over to the infirmary. I don't think there's anything interesting at the quad. I mean, you can talk to some people, and they say stuff that I don't really find all that interesting, and Renoa doesn't say anything there either, I don't think. So, we're gonna skip over that one. Let's check out the, uh, what do they call this place? Oh, the infirmary! Well, there you are. I thought it might have been called a hospital or a sick bay or something, but okay, it's an infirmary. Now I know. Hey, Doc. How's it going? What's up, Doc? Um... Yeah, yeah, she is my girlfriend. Sure, I'm serious. Absolutely. Woohoo! All right, Squaw. F oh, <laughs> finally settling down, I was going to say, but nah, nah, just kidding, Renata. Ha ha ha. Uh, sure. Um... Well, wasn't he in his office? Oh, I guess we could head on up there. But, um, let's see, did she say anything else? Oh, okay. Yeah, I suppose he could be in a bit of uh, trauma after that whole thing. Well, at least we don't have to walk down those long hallways to get to each area now. Shouldn't Renoa know what this place is like already? I mean, she did come here before to make that proposal to Sid. Although I did only see her at the dance hall there. Where was the dance anyway, now that I think about it? I mean, it couldn't have been in any one of these eight areas. I never thought about that before. I mean, where could that have been? Oh, and you heard that little noise there? All right. There we go. I actually get to show this on screen. That, that little sound you just heard means that we learned a new limit break for Renata there. So let's go for another one. Recover. Let's go for that one. Whatever. But yeah, whenever you walk around, you get a little noise with Renault there that indicates that. Here's the parking lot. It's dark, gray, boring. Kind of like me. Why do they have the parking lot here? I mean, it's not like we can ever get a car from here and go somewhere. I mean, we're on a freaking island. Where are you going to go, Squall? Well, now we're going to head down to the, uh, I guess there's a training center in the library that's left.
Hey, Renan, you want to go to the secret place at the training center? Wink, wink. Come to think of it, I don't think we actually can go back there anymore. I think it's like blocked off or something. The monster's lair. Not in this section, but there's monsters everywhere else. Yeah, come on. It's a hot date idea. <laughs> yeah, like a Goku and Chi Chi sort of thing. I remember seeing that episode of Dragon Ball. That was the funniest thing in the world. <laughs> okay, yeah, but that's all we get from Renala here. So let's get out of here. Maybe she's a book person. She doesn't strike me as being a book person, though. Maybe you should try holding her hand, Squaw. I don't think the directory works anymore to take you to wherever you want to go in the garden, now that I think about it. But, uh, at least they don't make you go through the hallways anymore. Oh, so she is a book person. Well, there you are. Maybe they banned libraries in Galbadia. You know, spreading of information and everything. I don't think she says anything, but we can go over here. Hey, oh, it's that girl from uh, earlier. The one at the beginning of the game and the one we rescued at the training center. Hey, how's it going? I've had a crush on you for this whole game, but I've had all these other women coming after me, but uh, don't, don't think anything of them, or especially Renoa. She means nothing to me. Really? She doesn't? Huh? What do you mean? Remember? You like a, an ex-girlfriend that I've purged from my memory? Or something? Hmm. That's weird. Wonder why we don't, why he doesn't remember her. Maybe she's, you know, trying reverse psychology on you. Or something like that. You know, pretending that she knew you from way back or something to try to get close to you or something? Huh? I don't think that's something she'd pull off. Let's leave Renoa here. We'll learn more about that other girl later. Okay, so... Oh, wait. Yeah, there's one other thing I want to do first. Uh, are you here to kill me again? Oh. Why would he want to see me? Oh, yeah, I did kind of, you know, save the garden and everything. Maybe he wants to give me a medal. Ah, okay. We can take the elevator to the basement level. Ooh. And they, they mean the just the first floor of the basement, not... Can I talk to you again? Ah, there we go. Ah, okay. We could go down to the basement to see the Garden Master. Or we could go play some more Triple Triad. So let's do that first. Now, I may not be able to do this part yet. Let's see what I can do first. Uh, let's see. Now there's... Let's see. Where is that guy? He sometimes shows up around here. I think that's him. There he is. Okay. If you talk to him... I think. Yes? No? Are you gonna talk to me? Hey. Hey, talk to me, man. Uh, maybe he's not the right one. Maybe I should just, uh, get my pay first, leave the screen, come back, and then figure it out. If I can't, well, I'll off-screen finding him. Uh, let's see. I think he walks in on the screen. There he is. There's the guy. That's the one I was looking for. The CC group. Uh, the card... What does CC stand for, anyway? Card club group, I think that's what it stands for. Uh, no. Why don't you tell me about them? There's a card club group here, and they're looking for people to play Triple Triad against. But, in order to be challenged by them, you have to win a lot of games here at Balam. And if I press a square button, no, he won't play against me yet. So, um, what I gotta do is I gotta win a whole bunch of card games. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go down here. Let's see. And, can I play against this guy? Yeah, but he, does, he wants to uh, mix rules, which I do not want to do. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play probably 10 or 15 games... However many you need to, I don't know what the exact number is, but once you do, then you can talk to that guy and play some Triple Triad in order to win some rare cards. Next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII! This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.